This week on Monster Model Review, in honor of the anniversary of the Apollo 11 first moon landing, we are stepping away from monsters this week. We have the Buzz Aldrin Rocket Hero, the 40th anniversary edition of the 148th scale first lunar landing plastic model kit by Ravel. The lander comes in 78 pieces, gold foil, authentic water slide decals, and includes scale figures of Neil Armstrong and Colonel Buzz Aldrin, the first humans to set foot on the moon while Lieutenant Michael Collins remained in the orbiting command module. Along with the lunar lander comes a diorama base molded to simulate the moon's surface, along with photographic and scientific equipment and the American flag. For this kit, I followed the instructions to a T. For taking the pieces off the sprue and cleaning them up, I used a wire cutter and an X-Acto knife. Then, using plastic glue, started gluing the craft together. I stuck to the colors in the instructions. I base coated the ground and the landing gear in flat black and used silver spray paint to cover the docking bay. As per the instructions, the only colors needed are black, silver, and gold. I also used a gray for the base and white, red, and blue on the figures. The only dry brushing I did was on the ground and the figures. I then used a watered down black to wash over the details of the base. For the figures, I started with black and dry brushed the piece up with white then painted the details, applied the decals, and painted the visor gold, and was done. The gold foil was easy to use and self-sticking, but glue is required to hold it in the tight spots. I put the decals on the craft, and glued the figures and equipment to the base, and it was finished. Also available from Ravel in the Buzz Aldrin collection is the 1 144 scale Saturn V rocket plastic model kit, and the 132nd scale Apollo spacecraft plastic model kit, also known as the command module. For more information on these kits and many others, check out Ravel.com. I'm mainly a figure kit builder, so it was a change of pace building the spacecraft, and I really enjoyed putting it together. We'll be doing more vehicles and special projects, but next week we're back to monsters. You can check us out at monstermodelreview.com, and thanks for watching.